Hi, my name is Alana Bach. I'm a fifth year PhD student in American Studies here at the University of New Mexico, and I also teach in the Women's Studies department here. Um, Hi, I'm Ramona Malchinski. I'm a second year PhD student in the Department of Geography, and I'm a TA for the Intro Physical Geography Lab. My name is Lindsay Marone. I am a sixth year PhD student in the Department of Linguistics and also a teaching assistant in the Department of Linguistics at UNM. We're all teaching assistants here at UNM and graduate workers. A graduate worker is a TA, RA, PA, or GA, and we do really important work for the university, which includes teaching our own classes, like many of us do already, grading papers, working in labs, working in museums, um, and a lot of administrative tasks as well. And we decided to unionize over long-standing issues of low wages, inadequate health care benefits, and uh, not a, um, poor working conditions. Uh, and we did not have a meaningful voice to address these concerns with the university administration. Yeah, so some of our successes in union organizing in the past year or so have been that we signed up 1,000 people with union cards within our bargaining unit within about three months in the midst of a pandemic, and it was the largest virtual card drive at the time. We've also withstood nine months of legal pushback and stalling from the university administration, and we recently got a ruling from the New Mexico Public Employees Labor Relations Board saying that graduate employees, just like all public employees across the state, have the right to unionize and collectively bargain. So this will set a legal precedent for all graduate employees in the state in the future. And we look forward to negotiating a first contract with the university administration in the next few months. And we'll keep struggling and making sure that we get all the issues addressed that need to be addressed for graduate workers. Give us vision, give us dental